Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> hey guys, Dylan AK Death the Kid. Surprise, surprise. I have my computer back and we are up and running Pokemon TCG Online. Um, Got some major ass packs codes and stuff for my friend AJ Zapata, AK Carlos Zapata. We got two of Evolution plus one because the lock also counts as a trade locked one. I got one through the newsletter from Pokemon. Then he gave me 12 of Steam Siege plus six Ring Skies, one Primal Clash because I'll log in today, I guess. I got a pack, so. And Phantom Forces, let alone five Fates Collide, and some break, one breakthrough, one break point, and 10 generations. Oh, that is a mouthful. But not only that, today is a special day. It's my sister's birthday. I will tell her happy birthday later when I get a chance. Not only to that, my Ash Ketchum hat finally came in. The one from Kento all the way back then. I ordered that, say, a couple weeks ago. And I got it uh, today of all days to, from my sister's birthday. Well, I got it. Today's my sister's birthday. Get my computer back and we're doing a pack opening. Well, today's just set in stone, I guess. Um, I'm going to possibly do the evolutions and generations last because it's to where those are the most valuable cards in those. So I'm probably going to go just like Phantom Forces first and then we'll go on and see where we go from there. FYI, I haven't actually opened a pack yet on here because I, I guess yet. Well, that went fast. As I say, like I, I had to re-download a lot of stuff. So yeah. Well, let's see what we get out of this Phantom Forces pack. Um, I haven't done Phantom Forces on TCG Online for quite some time, I believe. Looks like we got three new cards. Nice. That's something we'll start with. And Galvantula. That's funny because we get a Joltik right there. That makes sense. Um, Sure. Well, let's go with the Primal Clash since that was our freebie pack today. So, yeah. Let's see. Huh? And what do we get out of this one? Oh wow, we got Maxi's Hidden Ball Trick and then we get Archie's Ace in the Hole in the same pack, wow. We got Kyogre, is that a sign? Because we got Archie next to him? No, it's not, we got a Tentacruel, but it's kind of funny you get a Archie next to Kyogre. You, if you play uh, the original Sapphire and uh, Alpha Sapphire, you would get the joke there. Um, let's see. Let's go Roaring Skies. Why not? It's a better than nothing, you know. Like recently, Roaring Skies has been treating me well. If you see my physical pack openings, still I like left to right. I'm pulling pretty good cards out of that. So yeah. Okay, we got two Bagons. Different art though. Okay. <laughs> it makes sense. We got Bagon. And another one, and then Shogun. What's next? We go and pull the whole evolution line. Ooh, we got a Victini, but that's the reverse. I say, what's behind door number two? And it's an Unpheasant. Not really what you would expect, but still, it's an ancient trait. I will take that. Uh, let's see what else we could possibly get. Got a Jatini, nice. And Barticle. I say I never understood why they made a that as a Pokemon. Got one. I I can't know. Never pronounced that name, but I call her Wanda because I got a relative named Wanda. So yeah. And we got another Victini, but that's a regular rare Victini. I don't mind it, but still. Let's see uh, what we get now. We got Inke stealing a Meowth. Barry, I'm going to guess, and I just realized I can't really look at it when you pull the physical pack. But he's got ink around one of his eyes, like Inkay just sucker punched him. Uh, Inkay, you fool. We got Bayonet. Hmm, maybe that's something. Ernokuno, that's funny because to where one of my uh, TCG codes I redeemed, courtesy of my friend AJ, is actually a Moltres deck. I think this was back when Plasma Freeze was still a thing, so yeah. Makes sense I get him. Or 
her, I guess. You never know with the legendaries, because in the game, they even admit they're genderless, so yeah. P-Dove is one of the new ones. And we got Jirachi, which I love this Jirachi art, because I physically have this as a think, reverse or a hollow, I forget, right now off the bat. It's like he's saying, hi, how are you? But let alone one of the moves is the greatest move when it comes to Pokemon for Jirachi is Doom Desire. That's like an OP move. And we got Altario. Nice. I say, I'm also really hyped for Sun and Moon that comes out this Friday. I'm planning to get both versions. It just depends. Like, if I can do it, you know, because financial wise and all that. And. We got Klefki as the reverse. And Reshiram. I've actually never pulled a Reshiram. That's pretty nice. I've never pulled a physical one too, if I'm pretty sure of. So Reshiram out of a TCG Roaring Skies pack online. I'll take that. Let's see what we got next. Well, looks like everything else we've seen. We've got Zapdos. Well, we got the whole legendary bird collection, I guess. Even though I've got that Zapdos from this art in a starter deck. Uh, and another Victini. Uh, I've got most of Steam Siege, so... We'll, you know what, let's go through uh, some Breakthrough. Get it? Go through some Breakthrough. Eh. I know that was a horrible pun, trust me, but... I feel a little bit happy, you know, I got computer back, sister's birthday, and I got my hat. In fact, if uh, I forgot to mention this, I'm wearing it right now while we're doing this opening, so hey. Got Piplup, Magnemite, and the same Magnemite as our reverse, Burning Energy, that's pretty good. And we have a Parasect, regular rare. Alright. Say so it's not that bad. I, I could ask for more, but, you know, I've not really, because it's like, nowadays with TCG Online, I'm getting pulls left to right that are good. So it's like, I'm not asking for much. It would be nice, though, if one of these days I open an Evolutions pack physically and I pull that base set reprint Charizard. I, I would be going. I would be like, you guys, I'm sorry, my career as TCG op Pokemon opener is done. Because that card is still worth a shit ton of money. It's like, I would be done right then and there. It's like, you won't be seeing me pulling them anymore. It's like, nah, just get it on back. <laughs> uh, I would still be in shock, though. Like, when I recently did that Roaring Skies pack, not the one recent, I guess the one before, I was still in shock. It's like, out of five packs, I pulled that card. It's like, okay, um, my heart just skipped a beat when I pulled it. So, yeah. Uh, of course, it's taken forever to load these ones. Guys, give me a sec, and I'll start recording again when, like, there'll be a little animation because this is going to take forever. I'll be right back. And I just realized it hasn't stopped. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Let me try that again. Pause. All right, guys, I'm back. It's kind of sad it took forever for just one breakpoint pack, but let alone I thought I had stopped the recording when I thought I tried the first time, but yeah, I didn't. <laughs> I guess you could say that'll be a little bit of a blooper today, so hey. Let's see what we get out of this breakpoint pack. I bet you'll probably do the same with Evolutions when it takes forever, because that's the newest set, and I've yet to open any of those on here. Well, we got a, I think that's a clay version of a Nuzleaf, not bad. Let's say we got Seed Out as well. Could we pull the whole Evolution line, maybe? Hey, get off. We got a Splash Energy too, so that's pretty good. Ooh! Nice, it's, we also got its first version. I am not even going to take a, a stab at pronouncing the names though, so yeah. Oh, nice! That's one way to give it to me. Palkia EX. I will take that. Uh, for a bit there, through this whole opening, I was like, I was afraid I was going to get nothing, but I I've never actually pulled Palkia EX on here, so I will take that. And let alone, that was out of a breakpoint pack, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a breakpoint pack. Wow! 
Um, let's see, we got Generations. Let's go Fates Collide, why not? I'm pretty sure there's some cards I have yet to pull in that one. Let's see what we get. Hopefully something good, because I was surprised to get that bulky EX. I mean, that's something, you know. Uh, double colorless energy. We got the Invincible Shuckle. In other words, for people who know Gen 2, you know what I mean by that, or Shuckle in general. Uh, Carbink. We got a... Yeah, I almost said something else. King? Yeah, I almost did it again. Oh, boy. Kangas Kong. There we go. That's a reverse. I was, say, I was gonna about to say Gengar. Wow. Oh, boy. I guess I can blame it on Snorlax. How about that? Let alone Z move and Sun and Moon looks like a fucking nuke. Its size just looks, looks like it gets angry and it just nuke jumps up and nukes the Pokemon right there. It's like, what the hell just happened, you know? We got Kainy and Team Rocket's handiwork. Whoever drew the artwork for this, I gotta give them props because it looks like they're giving you a look like you're gonna die look. Oh, nice! I will take that. That is the Alakazam EX. I'm pretty sure that's the secret rare, ain't it? Yeah, that's the secret rare, uh, secret rare version. Wow, I will take that. It's so funny, I think one of these times I actually did a pack opening once. Yeah, it was the Garvor one I did. I, I mean, I had actually pulled of a secret rare. I don't think I said it was. I completely spaced it out, so yeah. That's kind of funny, though. We still got, like, what, one more pack after this, I think? It would be funny to pull the Mewtwo one out of it, I think, that's in this. Um... Mothum. I, say, I never understood why that's a Pokemon. I, I guess you could say it's to... I guess... Well, here's what my theory is. is Dusk Tox was its relative, maybe, and then for, like, uh... Beautify was maybe related to, I don't know, Butterfree, maybe. I don't know. That, that's just off the top of my head. I'm just going, I ask. We got a seal. That's pretty nice. Oh, shit. It makes sense we get this, though. Genesect EX. It makes sense, though, because this is the Pokemon that they're giving out at GameStop right now via the code. That makes total sense. It's kind of funny. Oh, we got one more. Fates Clyde. This is the last one right here. I say it makes sense though that I get that. Oh boy. Alakazam Spirit Link. It would be funny though if I get a Mega Alakazam because we got the secret rare Alakazam. Could we get a Mega? <laughs> I might be pushing my luck. Hey, we got Zygarde. Nice. And I'm not taking a stab at that name. I always get it uh, confused. So yeah. See, we got Evolution, Steam Siege, and Generation. So let's go with some Steam Siege, because I mostly got every single card out of that, I'm pretty sure. But not all of them. And it's going to take forever to load, as I figured. Be right back, guys. This is going to take for a while. Alright, guys, I'm back. Sorry it took a while. It's just, you know, like I said, I had to re-download TCG Online. So it's like, it's going to take a while for certain packs to open, you know. I'm pretty sure it's going to do the same for the Evolutions pack and maybe even the uh, Generations packs as well. So bear with me if you would, please. Let's see what we get in our 11 packs of Steam Siege. Let's say, be surprised if I get a new card because it's like I've basically pulled all of these. So yeah. Yep, yeah, Mega. Already got. Let's see. It's kind of funny though, because it's like, I'm pretty sure out of all the TCG Go packs or, I mean, codes added, added onto here, like for pack wise, I'm pretty sure I may have done the same when it comes to the actual physical set of Steam Siege. I probably like got a lot of them. And it's like, I'm pretty sure I've got a lot of them on my binder. Uh, we'll see though. I might have to check the list and see. It'd be funny though, it's like, I go to look and maybe, I don't know, I haven't had the complete set yet, but it's to where TCG Online said, I basically have completed most of Steam Siege's list on here. So it's like, what? Oh, well, speak of the devil. We got a new one, but I've already pulled that out of another set. 
And we got Nido King. Nido, I meant to say, my bad. Nido King. There we go. I misspoke. And now it's going to take a while. Great. But not that long. So, hey. But going back to my hat, I'm surprised I actually got it today of all days. So, yeah. It's to where I wasn't even expecting it. It said either November 14th to I think it was somewhere in December so I'm surprised it's like today I get it of all days and we got two new ones one is that new lobster looking thing I'm not gonna even pronounce his name and Pokemon Ranger the reason why is because sometimes names trip me up and then people in the comment section will say no it's spelled this way or it's said that way and it's like I'm not even gonna try because I probably butcher it and we got Toxic Rogue I think, uh, yeah, I've already pulled Toxic Oak. Oh, and that went fast. Let's see here. Well, we got two din Dinos, or whatever, however you pronounce his name. And, oh, well, that makes sense, I guess. We pull the uh, first one, and then we get its evolution in the second pack. Come on, Steam Siege, we're working fine just a couple minutes ago. Alright, so there we go. Let's see, I'm already happy we got an AP Palm. I like AP Palm, he's funny and cute at the same time, so hey. We got, I'm not even gonna take a stab at the name. I'm sorry, some of you may be wanting me to say the names, but I swear I can't pronounce them, so yeah. Pro Pass, I can pronounce that. It's funny though, at certain names I can remember off the bat like that, but it's like names I really don't say a lot. It's like I look at them and I'm like, I'm not even trying, you know, to pronounce it. Let's see here though what we get in our, what, six pack of Steam Siege, I'm pretty sure. Uh, we'll see, I guess. Well, I guess not six pack going in, but we have six left. I don't know if this is like the sixth one I'm opening right now. I mean, not, not now, but it's to where it said how many I had left behind it. It said six, so yeah. Ooh, nice. A friend of mine, Iris Garbor from Google Plus would like that. <laughs> I know that. And, ooh, we got a, ugh, I can't think today. We got an uncommon that I don't have, and that's Weavile. I like Weavile though for how it is, I guess. How it looks and everything, not how it acts. So yeah. I mean, the design on it. It looks like it's got a little crown above it. So yeah. Tangle Growth, not bad. And we got Samurott, nice. It makes sense though I get Samurott when I was just playing, uh, what was it, Pokemon Poke Park 2 and Samurott's actually one of the people you see in it. And this is the Wii version, guys. I don't think they're on any others, but just throwing that out there, just in case. Another Toxic Rogue. Hmm. Come on. I say, give me like something I need to jump for. Hmm. Not really. Corbalion's a sadly a common rare in this. I don't know why they put Corbalion as it. So yeah. It's like when I'm opening packs and I see Corby Alien as a regular rare, it's like, what? Prime Ape. But yeah, it's to where when I first opened my first Steam Siege pack, and I, I don't know if it was the first one or a couple afterwards, it's to where I've seen Corby Alien as a rare. It's like, why is Corby Alien just a common rare? And you think we would have something better for him. Toxic Rook. But then again, this is like months after Corbalion had been released, and it's like months as in like a lot of months, so yeah. And jump off. Alright, let's go with the Generations packs, because I want to save Evolutions for last, even though I have three of them. Oh, well, I guess Generations was being nice to me. It, it just loaded up fast. I'll take that. Let's see here, we got an energy, we got a couple of, of 
newer cards that I haven't got because then again I haven't really opened any generations because you can hardly find them on TCG online so yeah we got magic card we got fairy we got Pikachu one of the mascots on the cover we got Swablu Graveler nice Pokemon fan club Diancy I don't even understand why Diancy is a common in this I don't know why Clefable, I guess you can make sense. We got Clefairy and then Clefable. And our rare is Parasect. Dude, get your own room, Parasect, and quit trolling me. Serious. This is the second Parasect we've pulled. Alright, I see we got Zapdos. That's pretty nice. I mean, Zapdos. Ugh, misspoke, guys. Kill me in the comment section if you want to. Zubat. Magmar. Shoulder, fairy energy. I've never pulled a fairy energy. Okay, I've seen everything. Swap blue. Well, it's not the hollow base Charizard, but I'll take a Charizard. Gold bat. And what? We've I've never actually had that one, so that's pretty nice. And Parasect, really, you troll. You freaking troll, Parasect, really. It's like it's seen it from the first time I opened. It hurt it first time. It's like, you hurt my feelings. You're just going to get parasick now. <laughs> it's like, screw you. Seriously. And, ooh, Flareon EX. I will take that even though I'm pretty sure. Nope, I guess it's not. It says I have had it. So I haven't had it. So I have a new Flareon EX. Okay. And we got Snorlax. Wait, what was that one move? Sleepy Press. It heals itself, but also does 1200 damage wow that's got to be some major damage right there let's see fighting energy and we got monk chop i think i'm pronouncing that it's been a while with some gen 1 names so yeah clefable monchoke looks like he's doing some meditation there while flexing his muscles we got gil dude nice nice Ooh, another EX! Sylveon EX! Evolution lines, here we come! Oh, look at little Eevee in the back. That's so cute. What's the last one? Eh, Golem. I'll take it. I say, that Sylveon card, though, Eevee in the back, that was cute as all heck. Eh, Cloyster, not bad. Haven't pulled him yet. Oh, damn! We got three EXs, let alone we got Garvor EX. I will take that. It's like the EX train be real now. And Dodrio, nice. If we pull another EX out of this next generation's pack, I don't know what I'm going to do. I, I am like, I can't physically sell these packs. It's like they're on the TCG online. I can't do it. We got Uvelto. That's funny. It's like I was just thinking of uh, like could we transfer Pokemon from X and Y and Megaru yeah for Sapphire to Sun and Moon I don't know if they will let us but it's like they did that with the Pokemon bank when I think it was X and Y came out and you could do the same for uh, Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire so maybe I was just thinking about that today and the rare Hitmonchan uh, okay I say break the train though but all right I say if we were to pull a fourth EX, I, I would be done. Oh, wow, this guy, I remember that. Oh, wow, I got two of them, that's funny. That's funny right there. For those who don't know, you would actually have to uh, play the actual Pokemon TCG back on Game Boy Color to figure out who this guy is. That was funny how that, he was just a random side character, but he was funny at times. We got Jirachi too, so yeah. And, whoa, another EX, Meowth Stick, I will take that. I guess you could say Hitmon Chan broke the train, but now it's rebuilding, I guess. I don't know, just an idea for a thought. Uh, I'm just gonna go to the rares now, cause it's, I think we're, yeah, we're pretty much long into this video. I was doing a major ass pack opening, I guess. We got Pinsir, so hey. 
And it's like we still got the evolutions packs after this. It's like we're going down the wire, but it's going to take a wild upload, you know. We got maintenance. And we got Snorlax as the reverse. Mm. Oh, another evolution Vaporeon EX. Nice. And now we're down to the last one of generations, which why I'm saying it that way, because the next three packs are evolution, which is the base at reprint. Oh boy. Well, we got another Flareon EX. Different art though. I like this one though, because it's cute. Oh, that's just like adorable. I mean, look at that. That it is so cute. You got all of them looking at you. It's like, hey. Oh, wow, double the EX. Oh my God. Blastoise EX. Well, that just happened. Two EXs off the bat. Nice. One full art and one just EX. I'll, I will take that though. That's like hardly happened to me, I'm pretty sure. All right. I gotta say a prayer to Arceus right now because evolutions, base set reprint. Could I possibly pull the Holy Grail of Holy Grail and Pokemon cards? And possibly pull the Charizard Hollow Base Set Reprint. Arceus, please help me here. I need to get that card. Please. And Arceus, we name your name. Pokemon, I don't know. I don't know how you say it. Amen in Pokemon. So there you go. Uh, Alright, let's see. I guess it didn't take a while to load, so hey. Um, we got, oh, look at all this nostalgia art. This is, this old art is nostalgia right here. I swear to God. Uh, let's see. Oh, break card right off the bat. Arceus, thank you. But it's still not what I want, though. But I will take that. Say, it'd still be good, though. It's a Nido King break. I will take that. And Dugong. I always... When always hearing Dugong in the anime, how he says his name, it's like, Dugong! It's like, really? That's kind of funny, but yet it's cute at the same time. So, yeah. I guess you could say maybe this hat is good luck since I am wearing it. Since we're talking old school base set to where some of these Pokemon are the Kanto uh, Pokemon is to where I'm wearing Ash's Kanto hat. So there you go. Whoa! Mewtwo, and oddly enough, I don't get this why they do this. This is in the physical packs. They made Mewtwo not a hollow. It's like, what? It's like, really? Why not make it a hollow? In the original base set, you made it a hollow. So I don't mind it, but still. Let's see. We got the old school art Pikachu. I guess you could say that was way before he decided to slim down a bit in other words there's a joke and it's also a meme like if you've seen Pikachu now to back when Pokemon started you can see he's trunk weight majorly it kind of makes me wish though they actually had the uh, weight on the newer ones like if you could see the comparative difference I don't know well we got Dugong again I don't mind it a little cute smirk there too but yeah, guys, I'm back. This has been one hell of a major ass TCG online pack opening. Please sure to like and comment. And let me know down in the comment section, how did I do? I think I did pretty well, to be honest, quite frankly. No base set reprint Hollow Charizard. I, I don't mind it. With the cards I got on here, I, I can't complain. But... I also want to mention something else before we end this video. Um, I planned it and it's to where I couldn't do it because my computer was acting up. But I wanted to let you guys know I am planning to do some more scary games. Yes, I know. I said in October. I planned to, to do them all October and I only got one out and it's to where also I said I would only do one per week again. And I never did get to do one. Well, I'm planning to do that. Let alone, I'm planning to buy a certain game off Steam and maybe challenge a certain Lord Emperor from a certain anime to one. And only one person that I have talked to knows 
who I mean, and that's Marcus, a good friend of mine. So until then, guys, you, that is your decision if you want to find out. But you're going to have to try to guess because I'm not going to let you guys know until if I can do it or not. Till then, talk to you guys later. Bye.